Yo, 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 what is up, my Cobros? It is I, of course, your favorite and super magnificent common bear. And today we are going to check out my first ever Bakugan Geogon Rising product. It is Arcleon, as you can see there, that's his, that, <clears throat> that is him in his uh, full on beast mode. And these Geogon, are the modern version of modern day traps of the legacy Bakugan line. So he, here he is, as you can see, he's a square. He's not like the traditional uh, Bakugan ball form. And here's the back. As you can see, you can go onto the Bakugan fan hub. And there he is, like when he's opened up. And it includes one Geogon, two ability cards, one gate card, and one Pekagon toy battling rule sheet. And as you can see, you can pop open. And that is the Pekagon action. And here are the others that you can get. So I'll be right back and open this for you guys. Alright, Cobros, I'm back. So, I thought that before I actually show you the Geogon of Arcleon, I should show you what they do uh, for this year. So, Geogons. Once each game, when a player is about to lose a brawl, if they miss their roll or have lower B power than the, than the opposing Macagon, they can announce a special Geogon summon. This means they will use one of their Geogons to... So substitute for that brawl by dropping it onto a gate from one card length up and use that Geogon's B power. So basically, it's basically a, a, a tag team r rather than, um, or, or rather than the, uh, rather than the official traps of the Legacy Bakugan line. So, so this is what it comes with. I already showed you the, I already showed you the manual. So here is Arcleon, as you can see. For for this year, we don't have uh, backup gears or anything. Instead, we have these, which they are not uh, which they are not shit shaped like like regular Bakugan. Here, I'll I'll, I'll show you just an, another Bakugan. Now here's um. Here's Halcor X. Now this was a fusion Bakugan in Armored Alliance. And as you can see, it had like it had an original ball form. But these guys are gonna be well, well different, and as you can see, they 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 have translucent plastic all over so that's how you can tell the difference and plus they're not they, they aren't ball shaped and before i actually pop open him he, he, here are the here are the cards you got the arcleon character card which is not actually a character card it is something that goes into your deck so it's very so so, so basically it's very it is very random and plus I don't know if you guys can see it, but they have embroidery on the actual card, and I think that's really cool. And here's the ability card. Call Searing Strike. It costs two energy, and it gives you plus 400 B power. Now these guys, now these Geogon, I think... I believe aren't aren't overpowered because they they have like nine hundred and you can easily just like we'll, we'll we'll punch that out well out of the brawl, but you have to do it by one card length. And since I'm holding my phone, I'm just going to do approximately one card length of right there. Ah, on impact. There you go. So here's so here's Arcleon. As you can see, he's a lion with wings. 
And as you can see, his B power is 9, 900. And as you can see, he has a translucent tail, translucent wings, and a translucent mane. And I like the actual translucent parts because it looks like he's very crystallized. So there's Arcleon. And here's the gate card. Now what they did in Armor Alliance for the original ones was they just put like the, the actual characters on it and call it a gate trainer. For, for these, they actually brought back the actual gate cards. And you can see, see right here how, how much you would get. Now, 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 now these gate cards are from the original... Oh, uh, These modern gate cards are from the actual re reboot. But the original gate cards that these got these idea of, that, that these got these ideas from are from the Legacy but Bakugan series. So I think that they are actually pr pretty cool. So there you go. That is what you get in a that is what you get in a regular Bakugan G Geogon Rising G Geogon pack. So I hope you like this video. Like, comment, and subscribe, and leave me a comment telling and it, and leave me a comment telling me what you want to see next. As for now, this is Kick a Common Bear riding off. Stay calm and bear on, Cobros.